What's going on everybody? Hope you're all having a great week so far. This is Jordan with My Freedom Smokes and today we are going to be doing a review of the real pod mod system or the RPM system from Smoke. So Smoke won't stop. Uh, they, have, they, uh, they pump out products just about every week it seems like they've got multiple pod systems under their belt uh, and this is another one. I think what they're going for here is a cross between a mod and a pod kit and for the most part they did a very good job uh, for me smoke is kind of hit and miss in certain places but uh, this one is not bad it works very well uh, this it kind of has a I would say almost a cylinder feel to it and it reminds me the mouthpiece kind of reminds me of the Nord uh, which we'll get into a little bit more in one second after we open the box here uh, but it, it does have a good Nord feel to it, but I think the overall functionality along with the different pods you can use and it makes it an overall good buy in our book. Uh, we'll go over everything, all the details, all of the, all of the functions here in one second, but right now let's take a look inside the box and see everything this comes with. Alright, so you've got your user manual, warranty card, your USB, standard USB cable, two pod systems, and two coils. So you get a 0 0.40 mesh coil pre-installed and a 0.6 Nord coil pre-installed. So that's the main difference here. One holds your RPM coil, one holds your Nord coils. So anything that the Nord uses, you can throw in this in this uh, this pod, and it will work. It'll be good to go. This is the RPM. This new one. This is the new uh, pod for it. So that's really cool. You can use the RPMs, or you can go if you've got Nord coils. If you like a Nord coil, uh, but you want to do kind of the the sub ohm, go to that type deal. You can also do that too. So very cool very neat they did a very good job but uh that's it for the box here let's close it on up so let's start up here we we're just talking about the pod these can hold about 4.5 mils of juice max which is awesome uh, both of them can the nord and the rpm uh, the only difference the rpm coils are a little bit bigger but both of these coils it's as easy as just pulling out to replace similar to the Nord just give it a yank and push in it's held in there by friction uh, you do have your your fill hole on the side here it's got the rubber gasket stopper it's nice and big and fit basically any any of your juice bottles in there uh, and it it'll fill very nicely it's uh, they did a good job taking that into consideration the different sizes but very I like this a lot because it is 4.5 mils for your sub or more mouth to lung setup. It's very cool. Moving down to the body, the, it's very stylish, the whole thing. It's got this one that we're using, I chose the black on black. Uh, you've got these carbon looking panels on the sides here and then very minimalist for your chassis. Uh, you do have two airflow slots. Airflow is not adjustable as the coils have their own airflow slots built in. But you do have these these slots here, which I mean the airflow is is on point, but we'll get to that in a second. Um, and then you've got your charging port at the bottom here. As for the screen, it's very bright. Uh, I'm glad that Smoke decided to put a screen on one of their pod systems. They haven't had a, a screen, not even on the Trinity Alpha. I think this is their first screen on one of their pod systems. So that's very cool. It's nice and bright. You can actually, there's six different colors you can change this thing to. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the actual wattage, you can take this thing up to 40 watts with your sub ohm. With your, uh, with your other coil, not yet, with your Neuer coils, it's not going to go that high, but it can read up to that 40 watts. It goes from 1 to 40 in 1 watt increments. Uh, the display, <clears throat> as you can see, I've chosen green on there, but very easy to read layout very simple everything's nice and big you've got your battery wattage uh, your puff counter resistance voltage <clears throat> and then your palette for uh, what color you'd like to choose for it it's just a fun system you can bounce from this to the Nord <clears throat> just whatever you're feeling kind of you can have them both filled they come it comes with two of the coils and the pods so this was really a hit for me 
and this is a 1500 mAh battery on the inside. I would compare it, it's, it's slightly bigger than the Nord, but it has more of a, so it's just got a nice cylindrical shape to it. I don't know if you guys tried the Cube, if you guys out there have tried it, this is what uh, it kind of reminds me of, just a smaller version of the Cube. Uh, it does use an IQR chipset. This device does read from 0.2 to 2.5 ohms, so any coil you throw in there from smart core or RPM, it's going to read. Uh, and the IQR chipset, I mean, it makes the ramp up time almost immediate. I'm going to take a couple hits from this thing so you guys can see. And this, again, is the, um, is the 0.4 ohm coil pre-installed here. And that's at 31 watts, which is about the rating for that coil. I think the 0.4 is rated 25. I'm going to go to 35. Just I've been hitting it at 35, and it's been working just fine. The taste is awesome from this thing. Um, with the other coil, the throat hits definitely there. I had that one filled up with some some low uh, low milligram salts. I've got some sub ohm juice in here right now. I've been using it for about a week. Uh, same coil, same everything. I've been bouncing around from 20 to 35, even taking it up to 40 a few times just to see, just to test it a little bit. But great flavor from this thing. Um, I've really been enjoying it. I would say that this this is for somebody. If you, if you bounce between sub ohms and pods, definitely add this to your inventory. It's, it's worth, it's, it's worth it. Um, just being able to, to bounce around like that. But on the other hand, if you like pods, you pick it up. And if you want to throw a sub ohm in there from time to time, it's, that's what this thing is built for. Um, very innovative, innovative in my book. Really been enjoying it. So I think we're going to rate this a nine today. Haven't had any any real issues with it. Can't really think of anything that they could have done to improve upon it. The button feels good. Uh, all buttons do, no sticking, anything like that. Great ramp up time. Just an overall solid device. So we're gonna have these up on our site in about four different colors. Uh, so stop in, definitely check them out. Maybe grab you one. Got some Nora coils laying around. It'll They'll work in it. And uh, yeah, come and get you one. But that's it for me, guys. Once again, this is the RPM 40 kit from Smokes. Uh, and this was Jordan with My Freedom Smokes. We'll see you next time.